Hi, my name is Luis. I understand that you were recently diagnosed with diabetes. I have been there and I want to share with you my diabetes story and help you learn the importance of taking care of your eyes. I am a 50 year old proud Puerto Rican, a husband and father of two grown children, each with a family of their own. And one of my favorite sights in the world is seeing the smiles on the faces of my three grandkids. That is why I make sure to take care of my vision. I recently made a doctor's appointment with my primary care provider because I was always thirsty, eating a lot but losing weight, and was constantly visiting the restroom. I was previously told by my doctor that I was at risk for diabetes. Diabetes is a disease that occurs when your blood sugar, also called blood glucose, is too high. Blood sugar is your main source of energy and comes from the food you eat. I knew I had some risk because my father and grandfather both had diabetes. At my appointment, my doctor told me I had diabetes. She told me if I do not take care of myself, high blood sugar can cause damage to my heart, kidneys, feet, ears, and eyes. She told me that I could take charge of my diabetes by eating a good diet and taking care of my prescribed medication. My doctor told me to see an eye doctor, an ophthalmologist or optometrist, to check the health of my eyes. I remember my grandfather had lost his vision in his left eye, and I shared that with my doctor. My doctor explained the importance of getting my eyes checked by an eye doctor, even if my vision seems fine to me. The eye doctor performs a full eye exam with dilation to check the health of my entire eyes, because sometimes there are no symptoms of a vision problem. The eye doctor can see things going on in our eyes that we cannot feel. I am so glad that my doctor encouraged me to pay attention to my eye health and prevent any issues from arising. I went to the eye doctor and conducted a full eye exam that included dilating my eyes with drops. This made me sensitive to light for a few hours, but it did not hurt. The eye doctor told me my eyes were doing well and talked to me about staying healthy. Diabetes related retinopathy can cause me to have trouble reading, seeing faces across the room, seeing at night, or even blindness. I learned that the longer I have diabetes, the more likely I will be to develop diabetes related retinopathy. But the good news is regular eye examinations can help to prevent vision loss. I have learned that there are many things I can do to help prevent diabetes related retinopathy. I can manage my blood sugar levels, blood pressure, and cholesterol by eating healthy, taking my medicine, exercising, and keeping track of my blood sugar levels. I have learned that being Hispanic puts me at a higher risk of developing diabetes related retinopathy. Luckily, I do not smoke, so that really helps too. The eye doctor informed me to look out for the following symptoms and to come right away if I experienced any of them. A sudden increase in spots or dark cobweb-like strands in my vision, blurred vision, sudden loss of vision in one eye, halos around lights, flashing lights, or poor night or color vision. I was told to come back in a year to get my eyes rechecked with a dilated eye exam so the eye doctor can monitor any changes. I'm going to make sure I never miss appointments. I hope you will remember the ABCs of diabetes to protect your eye health. A is for A1C. Manage your blood sugar and have it checked every six months. B is for blood pressure. Manage your blood pressure to protect your heart, kidney, and eye health. C is for cholesterol. Manage your cholesterol levels. D is for don't smoke. Don't start smoking, and if you smoke, quit. E is for eyes. Be certain to get a comprehensive dilated eye exam annually. If I do develop problems in the future, I will need to visit the eye doctor more often and we will work together to determine the best treatment options for me 
such as medications, laser procedures and surgery to protect my vision so that I can enjoy watching my grandchildren grow. I hope my story has helped you understand what you can do to keep your vision healthy. Nos vemos!